Greetings, Benjamin J. from Ben's Trainings with another in the series. Well, here's that 666 that arrived today, smoking really well, and uh, I just uh, put it in a new shell. So I swapped out the motor and the rear truck and stuck it in a shell that I had under the, uh, the layout. And this one isn't perfect either, but it's in much better condition than the one that was on this uh, when it arrived. So it's running really well. It's smoking really well. In fact, it's smoking better than any other engine I have. So I just want to take this around. I've got it on the uh, outside rail, the Lionel rail, pulling 20 Lionel cars. Just wanted you to see this thing smoking. And there's no traction tire on this. So as you can see, that is smoking really well. One of the best smokers I have, I think. Anyway, 10 bucks on eBay, and uh, I didn't have to do anything to it except lubricate it. I did swap out the shell, of course. But that's the whole idea of having parts. So this is running really well, forward and reverse, and really smoking. That's five drops of mineral oil. So definitely worth ten bucks. The smoke generator alone is worth more than that. And you can really smell this thing. That's one thing about having smokers, is that if you had four of them running, you could only run them uh, a few minutes at most before it gets really toxic breathing this stuff. Anyway, yeah, a really nice 666, runs really well, uh, dropped it into this new shell. Now, if I can't get this rust off of this push rod, I'll very likely just swap it out. But uh, I've got it oiled and I've got the majority of it off. It's still really discolored as you see. But uh, I can get this back down to bare steel with no problem, I think. This side is actually quite good. So, just have uh, one push rod to contend with. So I dropped the motor into the new shell and uh, swapped the rear truck onto this shell. And it's up and running and running really well. So I have no complaints. Ten dollars and uh, it is now the best smoking uh, locomotive that I have. So I just want to do a quick video on this. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to drop me an email. Benstrains at gmail.com. And as always, thank you for watching.